And the fourth memorial of Professor George Saitoti was observed by his family in a private ceremony yesterday. Family members are still pressing for answers on the mysterious death of the former internal security minister who died in a helicopter crash alongside five others in June 2012. Four years ago, Kenya lost then Internal Security Minister George Saitoti, his Assistant Minister Orwa Ojode, the pilots Luke Oyugi, Nancy Getwanja, and bodyguards Thomas Moremi and Joshua Tonke. Their families today commemorated them in private ceremonies. But what they would want public are answers on what caused the helicopter crash shortly before 9 a.m. on June 10, 2012, that took their lives. The helicopter crashed soon after takeoff on its way to Orwa Ojode's hometown, Liwa, for a fundraiser. Some indications from pathological tests hold that Saitoti could have been poisoned together with his assistant minister, Orwa Ojode, the two pilots and the two bodyguards who had accompanied them. However, commission of inquiry into the air crash led by then-judge Kalpna Rawal put to question the quality of pathological tests and toxicological investigations. Nothing is clear from the commission findings or investigations that included claims that the National Intelligence Service interfered with crucial evidence. Saitoti, who had also been a vice president for 13 years, was powerful and was among key players in the Mwai Kibaki succession contest. Mark Masai, NTV.